Welcome back to Token Road Infrastructure. We'll go back now to Ogun State, where workers' union at the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation Depot in Mosini Shigamo area of Ogun State have issued a seven-day ultimatum to the federal government to fix the Shigamo Ogijo Ikurudu Road now in a deplorable state or risk total shutdown of the depot to create scarcity of the petroleum product in the southwest. Correspondent John Felix reports. The Shagamu Ogijo Ikorodu Road is gradually becoming impassable. The deplorable state of the road has visibly made life unbearable for many road users. From a complete halt of vehicular movement to road accident, the latest leading to the spillage of petroleum products. This accident is just one of many that occur on this stretch of road, as it has resulted in commuters spending longer hours in the road, stranded and tired. Disturbed by the state of the roads, various petroleum unions, including the Independent Marketers Association of Nigeria, IPMAN, the National Union of Petroleum and Natural Gas, NUPENG, the Petroleum Tankers Driver, PTD, as well as the Independent Marketers Branch, IMB, NUPENG, take to the street in protest of the deplorable road. Speaking to Galaxy News, the union leaders lament the loss of their members to accidents, which occur as a result of the bad road due to its deplorable condition. Uh, for more than uh, uh, 10, 15 years. has been a very despair state. And uh, you will agree with me that uh, especially during this rainy season, we are facing a lot of hardship. As you can see, you can see lineup of vehicles. Some vehicles have loaded from Mosimi. Since three days ago, they cannot, they cannot go to the respective filling stations. We, are, we have been trying our possible best to try our best on this road, but it has come, to, it, it has come beyond our, 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 uh, our, our probability, our ability. So we want federal government to come and do this thing. And they can do it. Emphasizing that their businesses have become moribund, the union chairman expressed dismay over what they described as complete negligence of the road, where both the state and the federal government generate tangible revenue. The unions also want the federal government to give approval to the Ogun State government to enable it to rehabilitate the Shagamu Ogijo Ikorodu Road without further delay. They say they are ready to pay tolls on the road. I remember uh, losing millions of naira almost every week on this ferry road. You can see what happened now. This, uh, this just happened yesterday evening. See, the truck just fell down. So it's at Ghost Institute whereby if, let's say by several days, if government fail to find solution to this ferry road, we will not have choice than to shut down all the business. And this can lead to scarcity in Ogun State. And we don't want scarcity to happen. So we are appealing to government to please Find, to help us find a solution to this problem as a matter of urgency. If something is not done, urgently, urgently, there is going to be scarcity. Because this Mosimi depot represents, is a, is a major depot that is loading southwest. As the Ogun State government seeks to take over the road, only time will tell if the threat issued by the petroleum workers will hold water. From Ogi Joe, John Felix, Galaxy News, Ogun State. And away from the southwest, we'll move on next to Kaduna State, where the Quality Assurance Authority of the State Ministry of Education.